Morning, everybody. We got lots of us here today. Thanks everyone for coming out. If you can't hear and you want to come around here, that may help. We got a little wind we're dealing with. We'll especially need the junior high kids to listen up because we got a lot of people here. So if you would. Thanks, guys. Well, welcome everybody. This is a great event. We're very happy to see everybody out here today. Um, we're grateful for the junior high coming out to support the great day and uh, we're getting going on this project. So what's going to happen is we have, when you do a groundbreaking, we're going to have a few people uh, say a few words. We have our MP, uh, Rick Casson here. We have our MLA, Bryce Jacobs, uh, the Mayor, Rick Scow, and then from the County uh, Council, Randy Janisco are, are each going to say a few words about the participation in this project and why it's important to the community. And afterwards we'll have Stacy from the Soccer Association uh, conclude with a few remarks. So we'll get going right away. Uh, Mr. Casson, if you'd like to come up and uh, start out, I guess you can probably stand out here with us. Well, thank you very much, and uh, good morning, everybody. It's a great day in Carson. We already made an announcement uh, for uh, another project this morning, and we're here to make this one. And I'm very pleased to be here to represent the Government of Canada and our Minister of Ec Western Economic Development, Lynn Yalich. I learned one thing early in this project. Don't tell the soccer moms you can't do something. <laughs> and uh, grit is uh, part and Stacy and Paula good for you Stacy uh, I think you have the date that you first came to see me about this project it was quite a while ago so it's really really a pleasure to be here and what a asset this is going to be to the town to have all levels of government both and both the county and the town involved I was just talking to the county councillors earlier and, and why they're here is because their families will be using this facility and they wanted to be part of that and of course Mayor Scow I've known uh, Rick for a long time and uh, he's very, very pleased that this day has come and we're just uh, so proud to be part of it. And our 190,000, whatever, is, I know there's, um, it goes a little ways to completing it, but having the province and the town, everybody involved, just makes it that much better. And I already saw plans for the next phase from <laughs> Stacy, so look out, she hasn't finished yet. And hopefully we can be there for, uh, and help you out if we can, Stacy. Congratulations, this is going to be a great uh, uh, project for Carson is going to be a great facility. 535 children involved in soccer, and uh, a few years ago there was 32. <laughs> My goodness, good for you! Congratulations. Enjoy the facility. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you very much, Mr. Mr. Jacobs. Thanks, Jeff, and good morning, everyone. And to to the kids, I just say, this is what happens when you have a dream. The soccer moms had a dream, and this was the start of their dream. And because of their hard work and perseverance, they've made it work, and we're happy to be with them here today to uh, celebrate that. And I know that some of you will be able to play on that field. Rick and I will probably never play on it, but those of you who will, uh, I know you'll have a lot of fun. So congratulations to the soccer moms, and uh, I I'm surprised lately I've had to, I find myself having to justify the funding that's uh, come from the provincial government into this project. Uh, some people think that we it could have been spent better in other ways. But I honestly, I don't know how you can spend money any better when it will benefit youth and their parents and their families. So this is a project that will benefit families and especially kids. So to me, that's justification uh, sufficient to justify what we've done. So, on behalf of the Minister of Culture, Lindsay Blackett, and the Premier of Alberta, Ed Stelmack, I'm really happy to be here today and that we were able to make a contribution to this project, which I think has uh, probably helped a lot. So, thanks to my colleagues for making this possible. Congratulations to the others, the town, the county. Uh, this is the county's buggy back here, and uh, that's impressive that they're going to do the leveling here and get the field ready. I'm impressed and thank them as well as the town. So good luck, soccer moms, as we continue to dream. Thanks. Thank you very much, Mr. Jacobs. Mayor, you're easy to pick out of the crowd with your hat on there. <laughs> like to say a couple of words. <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. Do I have a chance? to keep this hard hat, or is this hard hat going? Some people tell me, I have a few people tell me, namely uh, 
uh, Dr. Bennett, the uh, school superintendent, that I look great in pink. <laughs> uh, but we'll, it'll, it'll stop there. What an outstanding event this is, ladies and gentlemen and children. Uh, I was in a meeting about a year ago where officials from Alberta Health were talking about uh, childhood obesity and juvenile diabetes is one of the most serious problems that our youth face. What a better way to remedy some of those concerns than with a huge, huge effort and a facility that allows us to play soccer and enhance the level of fitness of our young people. I've said it on many occasions, the best money we can spend is with our youth in education, in fitness, in safety, in protection, in health. This facility will go so, so many miles and so many generations and will unite families for soccer night picnics and all kinds of things. And uh, I just wish uh, Steve Gibbings was here. Uh, he happens to be my bishop, but I remember when I was a soccer coach back in the early 80s, he was this big and he was a runt and he had more hair then than he does now, but what a great soccer player. And so I was gonna rub that in, but I guess it's just junior high uh, students that are here. He'll get back. Support soccer, make sure that you put in your best effort, learn to play as a team, listen to your coaches, and tell your coaches thank you for the time that they put in. Tell your administration, your directors, your soccer uh, moms, tell them thank you for all that they have worked so hard to build this great community because truly soccer moms are community builders and that is very very important everybody county thank you for your participation we really do enjoy working together on projects whether it's the soccer or whether it's the academy what great additions to our community so thank you to the county uh, Rick Casson, a good friend of mine, as our outgoing member of parliament, uh, and of course our MLA, Royce Jacobs, our Premier, Mr. Stelmack, our Prime Minister, Mr. Harper, are concerned about rural Alberta, and they've shown it here with this wonderful soccer project. Thank you very much. As the Deputy Reeve of Carson County, I'd just like to express our pleasure in being involved with this project. This is awesome. Um, as you look at that list of participants and the little list on the side there, there's many people that have uh, helped out with this, and this is awesome. But the important thing is, when you get some ladies together with uh, an idea in their mind, they can move forward and get things done. And this happens all over the world like that. Uh, it just it just takes to have that fire in your heart to achieve something and i, I want to congratulate you for that uh, this interests cardston county because we like to uh, participate with the town of cardston and i hope that this is uh, an example of future participation that we can achieve together because our communities both the town and the county we're intertwined our youth from the county go to the schools we use the facilities here and uh, so anything that builds facilities in this town it also helps Carson County residents and we appreciate being involved in this project um, soccer is the number one sport in the world did anybody know that here the youth here it is the number one sport in the world wouldn't it be awesome if at a future date you could have somebody at the World Cup that learned to play soccer on this field in Cardston, Alberta. Wouldn't that be awesome? It's possible. So that can be our a big goal for the future. Thank you. We appreciate to be, be able to participate in this project. Thank you, Council. And we better hear from the catalyst behind the project. Stacy, would you like to come and say a few words?